Hey guys, so we are almost three weeks into lockdown and it's Easter weekend, so I thought I would do a vlog. Um, we are still in Australia, but I think we've kind of got to the point where we need to go back to England now. Our landlords are still wanting us to pay rent and obviously we've got nothing coming in. So yeah, we're gonna have to use the rest of our money to try and fly home, so that will be fun. Let's see how that goes. But yeah, I thought I would do a video as it's Easter weekend. Not that we're going to really be able to do much. Um, normally at home, we have a really big celebration for it. And we'll do like an Easter egg hunt. We all get Easter eggs and we have a big roast and all the family comes down for the whole weekend. But obviously, I can't do that. I don't think we'll have a roast either because our kitchen's really small here. So I think we're going to do something, but we're just not sure yet. But yeah, I just thought I'll record it. First off, I did get some new Vixen samples. So I thought I would show them to you guys. I have absolutely no idea when I'll be able to do them now. I did actually have new shorts coming in. The shorts that I already have, the blue serene and the black serene. I had a restock coming for those. But they're stuck in that kind now because they're in lockdown and they cannot send them to me which is really annoying because they've been ready for the past few weeks but I cannot get them so I have no idea when those are going to come and these other items that I've got for samples yeah I love them but I don't know when I'll be able to do them but I just thought I'd show them to you guys anyway so we'll have a look okay so I got a few different bits which I will try on I got the blue serene x leggings but I got them in scrunch because I just wanted to see what that was like and I actually really really like them in scrunch and then I basically got the serene x set but in black so these leggings are black they have a scrunch they are so soft like this is the best fabric I've ever felt in my life it's unreal um, and then sports bra and I got a couple jackets as well um like zip up tops but i'll try them all on and show you so this is the serene x but in black um it's exactly the same as the blue ones the red ones but the material is a little bit different these ones are incredible like this black leggings i could just live in them they're so 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 comfortable they're just insane i don't have the logos on any of these because the guy was rushing to make them for me because he knew he wouldn't be able to send them out because of lockdown so luckily i managed to get the samples in time even though there's nothing i can do with them but yeah, so I absolutely love this black. There is a scrunch at the back, I don't know if you can see, but it's kind of like a subtle scrunch, so it's not too in your face, but it does the effect, and I just absolutely love them. They're just beautiful. It is so soft, it's incredible. Um, let me see if I show you in the mirror. So, yeah. And then the scrunch, I don't know if you can really see, because the black, Yeah. I just love it so much. Then as well as this, I've got stuff to go on top. So um, first one is the cropped zip up, just like I have with the blue and the red. Thumb holes, yeah again, so cute. Zip up if you want, not. Yeah, I just love it. And then uh, I got a full length one. So for those who aren't as into cropped things. And also a bit warmer when it's cold out. So this just goes all the way down. And I really like this as well. So this is so comfortable. Um, I wanted to get this because Tyler has one and I always wear it. So I thought I should get one for Vixen. And yeah, I really like it. But I think I will want this bit a bit longer that it goes to the bottom like where the leggings line is because even though this is full length it um, sits a bit short and I think I prefer it to come all the way down but let me know what you guys think But yeah, so I love that. And then the blue leggings. And then these are the blue, which are exactly the same as the Serene X, but they have a scrunch, and I just absolutely love these. I think the scrunch just gives it that much more shape and definition. And yeah, I absolutely love these. But it's not too much of a scrunch, you know? It's a good amount. So that is all of the samples. Hope you guys like them. Let me know what you think. Hopefully I'll be able to get them out sooner than, I don't know, 
Who knows? Sooner than later. Sooner than later. Mm. Well, yeah. Hopefully I'll get them out at some point in the next few months, but who knows? We'll have an idea. Anyway, so we are going to go to the shops now, get some food for Easter. Um, it is raining outside, if you can see. This is the view from our balcony, which is so beautiful, which we're going to miss so much. Get our masks on. We're ready to go and face the world. This is the first time I've worn a mask. See how easy it is to breathe. Sorry, I didn't end up recording anything at the shop because it was so busy, but we ended up getting stuff for a roast, yay! So I'm so excited. It just doesn't feel like Easter without a roast. And I chose lamb. Lamb and Yorkshire puddings. I haven't had Yorkshire puddings for like over a year, so I am so excited. They're not very popular in Australia. A lot of people don't seem to even know what they are, but oh, so good. And of course we've got Easter eggs. Just little ones because I don't want to go crazy and eat loads and loads. So we just got a few little chocolates for tomorrow to celebrate Easter. So we are currently looking at flights. Tyler's playing solitaire. We're looking at flights home. We're thinking we're going to go to Edinburgh because we have to go live at my dad's flat because it's self-isolation. And that is up north, so it's close to Edinburgh and London. So annoyingly we tried to book flights but because we're booking all four tickets together um, the thing came up saying the card it's unusual activity so the bank needs to be notified first and the bank person needs to call the, the person but because it's Easter weekend you know we don't know when it's going to happen so now we're worried we're going to lose that flight. Ah, the stress. I'm going to go to sleep now and hopefully things will be resolved tomorrow. Good morning guys, so last night um, we sorted everything out with the bank, it was like midnight and we managed to book our flights home so it's pretty crazy, we have booked them for Friday so we just have to hope there's no cancellations and yeah we'll be flying home on Friday, it's pretty crazy so one week, less than a week to go, Sunday today so ah, madness feel so many different emotions right now it's pretty mad Tyler how do you feel about it so sad. yeah look what Tyler's listening to Ed colouring in masterpiece mm. I feel really sad that it's coming to an end early but I guess we did only have a couple months left on our visa anyway but yeah, there was a lot I still wanted to do and we still wanted to really go to Tasmania and New Zealand and Bali which we we're going to do at the end of the trip and yeah, so we'll just have to do that another time, save up and come back. It's so sad, I've loved Australia so much and can't believe it's all over. But yeah, we still have five days and you know, flights do get cancelled so we'll just see. See what happens. I'm excited to come home. I miss my family. Not that I'm even going to get to see them, but yes, I do love England. So pretty crazy revelations this morning. Um, but I'm just having a coffee now. Some rubbish little instant coffee, and then I'm going to go for a run before we start our Easter Day celebrations. I've just come back from my run and I feel amazing. Honestly, running is so therapeutic. You feel so good after you do it. Even if you can't be bothered to go and you sort of run, walk, run, walk, you do feel really, really good. What I've been doing to motivate myself is I've been going to parts of Melbourne which I haven't been to yet, so it's like I'm exploring. And that way I'm not like counting down the minutes of the run to end because it's really fun and enjoyable because it's like I'm exploring the city. And now obviously because we've booked our flights, it's even better because I'm just trying to see as much of the city as I can before we go and yeah just make the most of it so yeah if there's parts of where you live where you haven't been to yet then go for a run there because it's motivating and yeah you'll go a lot further so when i finished my run i passed by the shops even though it's easter sunday big w was still open which is like um a big 
it, Woolworths is a supermarket here. Obviously, we used to have that, but it got bankrupt or whatever in England. But Big W's like, um, you know, they do everything. I don't know. I can't think what we have in England that's like it. Um, I wouldn't say TK Maxx because it's not. It's like, I don't know. What do we have in England that you'd go to? God, I don't think we have anything like that. Up north they do, kind of. I don't know. But anyway, so I got a new suitcase. I just got a cheap one. Um, this was $39. And it's just because, obviously, I've got so much stuff. It's not all going to fit in one suitcase. So hopefully we're going to be able to book that to be sent off so I won't have to take two suitcases on the plane so we get like a delivery company to come pick it up and then deliver it to my house when back in England um hopefully we'll get that done so yeah it just means I've got my suitcase and I can start packing mm. also actually I got new colouring pens so look it's all cool colours and this is good because we don't have any colours like this so exciting and now it's time to shower, get ready, and celebrate Easter. So we're doing an Easter egg hunt, so it probably feels like Easter. Huh? You tried to stop Matt, what? I tried to stop Matt eating one, but he couldn't help himself. Right, all anywhere out down here, yeah? Yeah. So Matt, Matt in the loom? No. Oh, here's one. I, I found you don't have to open anything to get it. Hmm? You don't have to like, go in things. I found this one here. <laughs> Oh, here's one. How many are there? Five. We'll tell you when you're done. Here's one. Oh, I found it. Here. So now it's full. Oh, did you say we don't have to open no, anything? Have to go in. Oh, here's one. Oh. Mm. Why am I? Why am I? So we do have to go and think. Who's gonna watch this? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> this is just for my vlog. Maybe because you're looking on your phone. Do you want me to film you? Ooh. 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 Ooh
Yeah. What is it? Are you recording this or hating it? <laughs> Let me ask you. Time for game. watch a film to finish our night that film was so emotional i was literally crying the whole time apparently the korean one's even more upsetting we saw the turkish one because that's what's on netflix but honestly yeah that was that was emotional times man that is pretty much it for my easter vlog we're gonna go to bed now thank you guys so much for watching and the next vlog will be us trying to get home so exciting times i'll see you then bye